So I'm going to talk a little bit about my second chapter of work, which was doing prefab green homes. It was my humble attempt at thinking about some of these problems and how to make sustainable, healthy homes accessible to more people and utilizing uh, modular technology as a way to do that. We did a number of homes for people. We also did a number of homes as exhibits where the house itself became a learning tool for people to, to be exposed to what green homes could be. This is a home that we uh, built with Wired Magazine uh, for the Museum of Science and Industry in Chicago. We built this home as seven modules in a factory and through software and through the factory, we were able to achieve 50 to 75% less waste, depending on the material. We shortened the time frame. We made it more predictable. We were able to integrate the various sustainable green systems. We then set the seven modules to the site. We started setting them at about 7.30 in the morning. And by 4.30 that same day, I was walking through the house doing uh, the check with the builder, which was pretty exciting. Then we spent the next two months doing what we called the button-up work, which is connecting the modules to the foundation, connecting the modules to one another, doing finish work between them, installing the solar panels, the uh, green living roof, uh, elements like that. So in total, it took four months to build the house. And if you were going to do that with traditional construction, it would take you 14 months. And we did a number of other homes, too. Like, this house is not something that you would normally think of when you think of a prefab home. Uh, homes that would produce their own energy, homes that would recycle rainwater and gray water. Um, and it was really cool. Like, this house, this kitchen arrived as a fully completed module. It was wrapped in the plastic. We cut the plastic. I climbed in to see it. And it came with the concrete countertops and the tea cabinetry and the sinks and the glass cabinets, everything except for the fruit. And I just wanted to, <laughs> I just wanted to lick it. It was so beautiful. And it came all completed from the factory. And that's pretty exciting. Um, bathrooms that include water efficient fixtures, glass made out of, uh, or glass tiles made from recycled glass. And for the home that we did with Wired, we actually embedded software into the home itself as a way to allow us to monitor the production and consumption of energy and water, and also as a way to let us control the home really efficiently and effectively. Also with the work, we tried to use software as a way to make the process and the design process more accessible to people, to homeowners that they could have online tools that would let them sort of try on different materials or different, different designs. And what's great is there are a lot of architects and a lot of companies doing this work now, which is wonderful, but it's, it's not enough. 